Triglyceride is the most common type of fat that is digested in the body. This type of fat can enter the body through food or be produced by the body. Normally, triglycerides supply energy to body cells and are stored as fat in the body as an emergency energy source. A very high level of triglycerides in the body causes obesity. This condition is associated with an increased risk of other diseases, such as cardiovascular diseases. So, all of us should know its symptoms to control it as soon as possible. Stay tuned with PARS Health TV if you want to see these warning signs. What is triglyceride? Triglycerides are chemical compounds that provide the energy needed for body metabolism. Triglycerides are the most common form of fat digested in the body. These types of fats are the main ingredient in vegetable oils and animal fats. A triglyceride molecule is a form of glycerol. Tri means three fatty acid molecules plus glyceride equals glycerol, which contains three fatty acids and must be absorbed by the body. The triglyceride molecule is broken and decomposed into these parts in the small intestine. After that, they combine with cholesterol to form kilomicrons. It is the source of energy for body cells. When the body needs energy, fat cells and liver cells are sources of storage and release of kilomicrons. What is a normal triglyceride level, and what does a high triglyceride mean? The normal blood triglyceride level is less than 150 mg per deciliter mg /DL. The border level is between 150 to 200 mg /DL. High levels of triglycerides, more than 200 mg /DL, are associated with an increased risk of atherosclerosis and coronary artery disease, thereby increasing the risk of a heart attack. Very high triglyceride levels, more than 500 mg /DL, may lead to pancreatitis, inflammation of the pancreas. Causes. In medical terms, an increase in triglycerides in the blood is known as hypertriglyceridemia. Diseases that can lead to an increase in triglyceride levels are as follows. Uncontrolled diabetes. Kidney disease. Alcoholism. Hypothyroidism. Liver diseases such as cirrhosis. Obesity. Certain medications, for example, birth control pills, estrogen, beta blockers, immunosuppressants. Genetic disorders of fat metabolism. Symptoms. People with hyperlipidemia have the following symptoms. These symptoms include feeling of heaviness, fatigue, or bruises in the body, drowsiness, burning and feeling of increased body temperature and soles of the feet, leg and sole pains, headache and heaviness of the head, dry and bitter mouth, dizziness and buzzing, dizziness and heaviness of the head, drowsiness, and heart palpitations after consuming fatty foods and relieving these symptoms by eating water, lemon juice, or vinegar. Increased body sweating. Swelling and puffiness of the face. Solutions to reduce triglycerides. Doing regular and daily exercise. Having a low-fat diet. Using low-fat dairy products. Not consuming fatty meat and chicken. Using vegetable oils such as canola, corn, and olive instead of animal-based oil. Consuming high-fiber foods. Avoiding sweets and sweet drinks. Avoid drinking alcohol. Eating slowly and chewing well. Balance the weight. If you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe to our channel and press the notification bell. Now, let's dive right into the treatments of high triglycerides. Treatment of high triglycerides. As with diabetes, the primary killer of high triglycerides is a healthy lifestyle. A healthy diet, regular physical activity, and avoiding alcohol and smoking are the most important keys to getting rid of high triglycerides. If a person's triglyceride does not return to the normal range by following the lifestyle, drugs are used to reduce blood fat. Also, in a group of people with high triglycerides, this increase is due to enzymes and fat metabolism problems, so they must take medicine. What to eat for triglycerides? Considering that we said that proper nutrition is vital in treating high triglycerides, people with high triglycerides or who have a family history of this disease may wonder what to eat for high triglycerides. Here is what you should do. 
limit your sugar and carbohydrate intake. Excess sugar in your diet may be converted to triglycerides, leading to elevated blood triglyceride levels and other disease risk factors. Fortunately, several studies have shown that low-carb diets can lower blood triglyceride levels. Even a simple change like replacing sugar-sweetened beverages with water can lower triglycerides in many people. Eat more fiber. Dietary fiber is found naturally in fruits, vegetables, and whole grains. It is also found in many other plant sources, such as nuts, seeds, grains, and legumes. These items can be considered harmful foods for high triglycerides. Including more fiber in your diet can reduce the absorption of fat and sugar in the small intestine and help lower your triglyceride levels. Avoid consuming trans fats. Artificial trans fats are a type of fat added to processed foods to increase their shelf life. Because of their inflammatory properties, trans fats have been linked to many health problems, including elevated levels of bad cholesterol, LDL, and heart disease. Use oily fish twice a week. It is recommended to consume fatty fish because of their omega-3 fatty acid content. Omega-3 fats are essential polyunsaturated fatty acids, and you should get them through your diet. Salmon, herring, sardines, tuna, and mackerel are some types of fish that are exceptionally high in omega-3 fatty acids. Other dietary suggestions. You may have read about reducing triglycerides with apple cider vinegar. In one study, researchers found that participants who consumed apple cider vinegar lost more weight than those who took a placebo and had lower triglycerides and total cholesterol. People who consumed apple cider vinegar also increased their levels of good cholesterol. Regarding honey and triglycerides, you may have read in non-scientific sources that honey is a healthy substitute for sugar. It should be said that most of the content of honey is simple sugars, if it is received in excess, it turns into triglycerides. Detailed studies have not been done so far on the relationship between sumac and triglycerides. Although it is claimed that sumac reduces triglycerides, however, this claim does not have a precise scientific basis. It is the same with water and triglycerides. The most important drink to lower triglycerides to avoid is alcohol. Alcohol consumption is directly related to the increase of triglycerides in your blood. Green tea is a drink to reduce triglycerides. Studies have shown that catechins in green tea can help lower triglyceride and bad cholesterol levels. If you have any questions about high triglycerides, write your question in the comments section. And if you enjoyed the video, please like it and share it with your friends.